Hi, I'm Ryan from Map Search, and this is the final episode in the first series um, of the Envision Solutions. Hi, this is Ryan from Map Search, and this is the final installment in the first season of our Envision Solutions series. And today, I'm going to show you how to share your map and layers within the Envision platform. Uh, map. Envision was designed with uh, the needs of both large and small companies in mind, and that uh, includes building in the ability to for colleagues to share their work with each other within the product and not have to take any files out or upload any additional data. Um, so we'll get started. I'll switch over to Envision now. Bear with me one moment. Alright, and as you can see, I've already created a uh, map here, and I've just laid on some crude pipelines and uh, some dock facilities in the Texas City area. Uh, so the first thing I'm going to do, and this is to share my map with my colleagues, is I'm going to give my map a title. Click Save. Now this map is actually saved my account, and to share it, all I have to do is go over here to the Maps drop-down. Select my maps. It should appear here at the top of the list in just a moment. And there we go. I'll click Edit Map here. And then the shared box. Hit Save. And now, any of my colleagues who want to view this map uh, can pull it up uh, within their own Envision account. All right. So that's uh, creating a map and sharing it. Uh, let's look at the other side of the coin now, and uh, I'll show you how to pull down a map that uh, one of your colleagues has shared with you. Uh, so I started with a blank map here. We'll go over here to the Maps drop-down, and this time we'll go to Shared Maps. And as you can see, it pulls up uh, maps. This one was created by my colleague Sarah, and uh, as for these others, I'm going to go ahead and just do the Chocolate Bayou map. Click View Map, and... Here it pulls up pipelines and looks like some storage facilities, uh, once again, in the Houston, Texas City area. And um, at, you can see the layers that she has added can actually be turned on and off by me. And then I can save the map, call it whatever I want, and it won't affect the work that she has done. Uh, so you can customize maps or add to them, you know, take things away, whatever you want to do, and it won't affect your colleague's work. All right, so that's one way to share data. Uh, the other way, I'm going to show you real quickly um, just how to go through it, go through the steps. And this is actually has to do instead of with an entire map, which consists of a, you know, the base map, the one or more layers, uh, etc., and the zoom extent. We can do the same thing with just individual data layers uh, that we've created, either by search or uh, upload some other method. Um, to add those to my map, all I have to do is this time go over to data, select shared data, and then uh, find a layer that uh, one of my colleagues has put into the product. I'll just click this one. I have no idea if this one actually has any pipelines or data in, in this region. It doesn't look like it does, but uh, if we found where this was, we would uh, then see the, the layer that uh, Peter created, and as you can see over here in the table of contents, this layer is listed in shared layers as opposed to energy layers, um, which are within my own account. And um, it's that easy, really. Um, so to just to recap, we've shown you both how to save a map and share it with your colleagues, and then conversely pull down a map and or data that your colleagues have saved in the product. So let me switch back over to my camera. Just one second here. OK. And before we wrap up, I'm going to give you a note here about security. Um, it's a major concern for our customers, rightfully so. Um, just like with the uploaded data we discussed in another video, everything you put into Envision, and that includes anything that you do in Envision, is limited to your company's umbrella. Uh, the accessibility is limited to your company's umbrella, meaning nobody outside of your company 
our, our own staff included, can view anything you put into the product or um, anything you do in the product. Now, if you choose to keep the uh, your layers or maps private, you're certainly welcome to do so. You don't even have to share them with your colleagues. And uh, that's actually the default option when you create anything in addition. So uh, we'll go ahead and wrap up, and I appreciate you watching our first season in the Envision Solutions series. Uh, we will continue to post videos going forward. Uh, we're going to start doing them hopefully in response to customer and prospect inquiries since uh, many people will have the same issues and have the same questions. That's kind of the format these are going to take going forward. If you haven't already watched the other videos on our YouTube channel, I highly encourage you to check them out. And um, including our introduction video that gives you a little bit more background on the product. Um, also, visit our website, mapsearch.com, or shoot us an email, sales at mapsearch.com. Thanks again for watching.